Here we have a 2017 BMW 530d xDrive M Sport. Now this vehicle comes with over £15,000 worth of optional extras, all of which are listed on the website, but they include the M Sport Plus package, we have the technology and the visibility package. We also have the 20 inch alloy wheels finished in gloss black, all in excellent condition and unmarked. We have the blue M Sport brake calipers, the blue metallic exterior paintwork, the LED headlights, two gloss black front grills. We also have the M Performance Kit, which includes a gloss black front splitter. We have the side skirt extensions along the bottom, colour-coded door handles and door mirrors, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass for the rear passengers. We have the shark fin antennae up top, along with the gloss black rear spoiler just here, which sits nice and aggressive. We also have front and rear parking sensors and a reversing camera. We have the dual exit exhaust at the back along with the rear diffuser. If you press this button just here on the remote then the boot will pop open like so. Now inside of here you found we have plenty of space for whatever you may need. As you can see it goes quite far back with the storage net on the left hand side. Now if we just pull that back closed and then walk back round to the driver's side you find this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. There's a look at another alloy wheel. I'm going to take a look at the interior. So inside of the back first, you find we have the full leather interior. We have the affordable armrest in the center, fixed ISO points, plenty of leg space. We have the vents down there for the rear passengers. Premium Harman Kardon sound system, electric windows, brush metal door handles. We also have the ambient lighting on the doors. Taking a look at the front, again, we'll have the same leather interior. And both the front seats are heated and electrically adjustable, as you can see just down there. Driver's side has the memory function. We also have the electric mirrors and electric windows for char lock for the rear. Automatic lights and the automatic wipers. We have a multifunctional steering wheel. If we just take a seat inside, you find we have the paddle shifters on either side. We have the digital dashboard here in front of us. If you put our foot on the brake, press the start button, then the vehicle will start up for us. As you can see, we have the speed limiter and the cruise control just here. We also have the high beam assist on that stalk just there. The steering wheel is also electrically adjustable using this stalk just down here. We have the digital dashboard in front of us along with the heads up display if the camera will pick it up. If any of the screens are flickering, it's just the camera, it's not flickering in real life, so nothing to worry about. We have the different drive modes just down here, so click onto Eco Pro, you'll see it changes the dials. Same if you go into the sport drive mode, it was changed just like that. Now moving over into the center, you found we have the main infotainment screen. So on here you found we have the sat nav. We also have a range of media, such as the DAB radio. We have all these other options down here. Bluetooth audio, the USB, we have the phone connectivity as well just here. If we go onto the main menu, we can scroll through all these other options. So if we go to my vehicle, vehicle settings, go onto the lights. This is where you find we have the ambient lighting. We have plenty of colors which we can choose from just here. It all runs throughout this vehicle and really just look good when it is dark. We have the intelligent safety just here, making it a very safe car to drive. Along with the reversing camera, if you put the car into reverse, and the front and rear parking sensors are just there. Put it back into park though, and moving further down, you find we have the dual zone climate control, heat seats on either side, and the ice cold air conditioning working just as it should do, as you can see. We have the automatic gearbox, the different drive modes, traction control button. Inside of here, you find we have the wireless phone charging, the cup holders, and a 12 volt connectivity that can be closed like so. Shortcuts for the infotainment screen, we have the electric handbrake, parking sensors, and the auto hold button. Leather armrest, which can be opened up for more storage. But that's all that I'm going to show you guys today. If you'd like to find out more, then please check out the website. This vehicle comes with a fresh service, fresh MOT, HBI clear, competitive finance deals, and free nationwide next day delivery. Thank you for watching. Video test drive of this BMW 530D X Drive M Sport. Now, the purpose of this video test drive is to show that the vehicle drives exactly as you'd expect it to. So, as you can see, I'm going to have to fire up the steering wheel to keep it in a straight line. We're not going off to the left or to the right hand side, we're staying straight and true. We do have the multifunctions on the steering wheel, so we have the cruise control and speed limiter on the left, the volume buttons on the right. We also have the paddle shifters either side. If you want to set the car into manual mode, tap on the paddles and it will change gear. 
steering wheels are also electrically adjustable so you can adjust it just with the stalk down here to however you find comfortable and the digital dashboard here in front of us as well which can display different bits of information that you would have seen on the photos and also on the walk around video now if you listen carefully throughout this video test drive you'll also notice we'll be free from any unwanted knocks or bangs we also have the full lever throughout this vehicle for the front and the back seats. Very comfortable, easy to do two, three, even 400 miles in this vehicle and still get out feeling fresh. Both the front seats are also heated, which is perfect for them cold winter mornings. We have the main infotainment screen just here in the centre, currently showing the sat nav. We also have plenty of other features such as the DAV radio, Bluetooth phone connectivity and much more. Again, you would have seen on the photos. Below there we have the dual zone climb control with the ice cold air conditioning, perfect for these hot summer days. We also have the wireless phone charging, the automatic gearbox with the different drive modes. Now we're about to take a right hand turn to put our indicator on onto the industrial park where I'll be forming an emergency stop, put the car into reverse just to show that the brakes on the parking sensors work as they should do. So emergency stop now in 3, 2, 1, hold onto the brakes and then if you put the car into reverse, we've got the reversing camera just there along with the front and rear parking sensors, back into drive with no issues whatsoever. Now if this video hasn't answered all your questions then please feel free to get in contact with our sales team where they can answer all unanswered questions along with running through some inquiries of you. But that's all for me today, cheers.